as they head up into turn number three and four. The Hurricane Harvey 75 is green at Brewerton. I know Harvey Fink is smiling from above here as we go green. The Hurricane Harvey 75, it'll be the number 28 of J-Mac, Jordan McCready. He will lead lap number one. Brandon Carvey back there to the two spot. He's got Alex Payne and Tim Sears Jr. right there to challenge. Three car battle as Alex Payne getting into the rear bumper of Brandon Carvey, who's trying to stave off the 83 of Timmer. Tim Sears Jr. on the charge. Outside of row number two, he's to the two spot. As they make the way up into turn number one and two. Down the back straight away they go as we got a car. Oh, Jackson Gill gets clipped by the 63 of Jarrett Hervis in a hard contact there. Ryan Bartlett, I believe, was also involved over there. Might have got a piece of that one. Jordan McCready's on the gas. He's back to the lead, and we're under green. Tim Sears Jr., he was working the high side before that. Yellow, he'll go back to the well up on the top side. Drag race down the back stretch for the top spot. And to turn number three and four, Jordan McCready rolls the bottom. Sears to the high side, drag race into one. They'll still keep both lines. Is head up into turn number one and two. Battle for third, shaping up. Alex Payne makes short work of that. Here comes Matt Williamson for fourth. Yeah, Williamson, he's working the inside. Meanwhile, the battle for the top spot continues. Sears not relenting. He's driving it deep through the center of turn one. Left the car dance off of turn two. Got the hook up off of turn two. Hello, goodbye, new leader Tim Sears Jr. here on lap nine. Jordan McCready trying to fight back on that inside lane. No, as we watch towards the back portion of the top five, Dave Marcicelli started to come forward. Right now, you got to wonder, is it best to be leading right now going into traffic or better to be running second? I would opt to be where Jordan McCready is right now. As we got a car off the pace on the backstretch, it is Alan Fink in the number 28 machine. Yellow lights are on. Green lights back on at the VP Racing Fields making power point. Tim Sears Jr. planks that car out into the lead. Jordan McCready right there to try to challenge. Here comes Money Matt. We're three wide back there for fifth. Oh, and Darren Smith launches a power plant at him. Yup, won't have a mosquito issue now as the yellow lights coming on for the number 12 of Darren Smith. Tim Sears Jr. is on the gas. Great restart for Timmer. He grabs the lead in a one, but look at McCready fighting back on the high side. Yeah, McCready was right there on the restart. Sometimes you'll see the drivers slide themselves into turn number one and clearly take the lead off of turn two. McCready was there. McCready's to the lead here on lap 24. What a move by Tim McCready to get the lead back. Matt Williamson watches from the three spot. Alex Payne drops to fourth. Michael Moreska now up into the top five as Dave Marcicelli and Brandon Carvey after one another. Matt Caprera also into the mix as well. Battle for second shaping up. Sears on the bottom. Williamson on the high side. Give it to Sears as they head the one. Yeah, Williamson had to pick up that throttle pedal there as it got a little narrow. Wider back stretch there. Williamson through the center of turn number three. He's up to the number two spot. Now to cross the line. Williamson has the lead. Top four breakaway right now at the front of the field. Green lights are on. And Jordan McCready able to stay with Williamson into turn number one and two. Money Man on the bottom. J Mac on the top side. Drag race into three. Look at the 29 machine of Matt Caprera. Asphalt, dirt, you name it. It's got four wheels and an engine. He's driving it up to the number three spot. It's a battle for the lead. Is now starting to heat up. It's about to be a three-car battle. If Caprera's got anything to say about it. Does he have enough to clear? McCready here in the turns three and four. Not enough. McCready with a better drive off. Williamson's found it off a of two, though. He definitely has. As you mentioned, he'll catch that cushion again coming off the corner. He'll pull even turns with McCready this time into turn number three. Will he have enough to slide up in front of him? I don't think he's going to try it just now as McCready will take the lead back off of four. Yeah, Williamson has not committed to the slider in three and four. Not comfortable enough. Might do it this time. A better run off of turn two yet again to even turns in three. Tim, but he can't get it right here. McCready just that much better off of four. Trying to hold on. Oh, Tim Sears Jr.'s off the pace. Flat right rear tire, Adam. Flat right rear for Tim Sears Jr. And again, the yellow flag back out. At the VP Racing Fuels making power play. Boy, McCready got a better start that time. We'll try to clear Williams into the turn one, and he does just that. I think that last restart taught him, I cannot wait. I got to go, and he did just that. Here comes Williams into the inside. Marcacelli with a good jump. 
but the car pushing through the center of the corner off. McCree holds on to the lead. And Felix Watt all over the back bumper. Mark Nicelli for the number four spot. Yeah, Williamson, he threw it in there that time in the turn number one. All over the back bumper of McCready again. McCready slipped up in three a little bit. Willix off the pace. Will we stay green? No, yellow is out. And I'm telling you what, Williamson was about that close to taking the lead before the oh, yellow came out. Man, my goodness. Green lights back on and away we go. Jordan McCready, Matt Williamson after one another for the lead. Williamson by a half car length down the back straightaway. Yeah, Williamson with a better start than McCready there. Slide line and turns three and four. New leader, money, Matt Williamson. 56 laps on the board. Matt Williamson to the point as they hit the back straightaway. McCready falls to second. Final time for Money Matt Williamson into turn number one and two. The SW Service Center. Bicknell Racing Products number six machine. The current dirt car 358 modified series points leader. He's going to add to the win total here tonight. Four in a row in the Hurricane Harvey. Matt Williamson wins again at Brewerton. And here he is, ladies and gentlemen, out from behind the wheel, your Dirt Car 358 Series point leader, Matt Williamson. Yeah, that was a great race. Um, every time it got really good, the caution would come out. So I um, hope the fans enjoyed it. Jordan was fun to race with the whole time and uh, had to throw a slider there at the end to get by him. I knew we were laps were coming down. Yeah. No, I was trying. There was one lap I, would, I actually lifted down the front straightaway and... Um, let him go to the bottom and tried to go around the top because I knew I was good up top. So, but yeah, hell of a race. It was a lot of fun, and uh, I really got to thank Wayne Conn at SW Service Center. He, uh, him and Terry Vince put a bullet underneath this thing, and the motor runs really well. And um, you know, I got to thank them too. We probably wouldn't be standing here without them.